Welcome to Electron Online. Now we're going to take a look at when we divide numbers with uncertainties, what we must do. And it turns out the rule is exactly the same as with multiplication. We're going to convert the uncertainties that are written in numbers into percentages. And then when we divide, we also add the uncertainty in percentages, just like we did for multiplication. So let me show you. First of all, we're going to convert 0.6 to a percentage. So we take 0.6 divided by 45 point six and multiply times hundred percent and we're going to do the same for here so 0 0.8 divided by 24.8 times 100 percent so that means we convert both of these numbers into percentages relative to the actual measurement of course when you divide this by this it's basically taking a ratio between two measured values so we have 0 0.6 divided by 45.6 and that would be 1.3%. And then if we take 0.8 and divide by 24.8 times 100% would be 3.2%. So that means we're going to rewrite this as 45.6 centimeters plus or minus 1.3%. That would then be the uncertainty divided by the quantity 24.8 centimeters plus or minus 0.8 becomes 3.2 percent. All right, now we can go ahead and actually do the division. So this is equal to 45.6 divided by 24.8. So 45.6 divided by 24.8, and we get 1.84. 1.84. Since we have three significant figures here, we want three significant significant figures in the answer. Notice the units would cancel out. Centimeters divided by centimeters is just simply a number. And that would be plus or minus. That would be 1.3 plus 3.2. That would be 4.5%. And then finally, we then reconvert to a number by figuring out how big 4.5% is of the number 1.84. So 4.5% of 1.84 equals, so 0 0.045 times 1.84 equals 0 0.08, 0 0.08. So now our final answer then becomes the following. This is equal to 1.84 plus or minus 0 0.08. Notice that the, the uncertainty has one significant figure, just like the uncertainty had here, and that the decimal place, there's two decimal places here, and there's two decimal places in the uncertainty, which is the correct way of writing it. So this then becomes the final answer relative to the division that we just did. So the rule is, you have uncertainties in the numbers that you're dividing, you then convert the uncertainties into percentages as a percent of the numbers that you measured, then you add the uncertainties when you do the division, and then you reconvert back to a number so that the uncertainty is expressed in terms of a number rather than in terms of a percentage. And that's how we do that with division.